This is how to get an email reminder through Airtable without Zapier. All you need is three columns and an automation. So this is my homework tracker, just using a simple example. I have due date, which is not a formula. This is just manually inputted. Um, so this might be like birthdays or upcoming projects. Next is my now formula. This is very simple, just my date time format. Uh, then just having the date. To make it more complex, you can put like time if you want specific hours, but we'll stick with this for now. And then my due in one day. And I'll put all of these formulas in the description so you can just copy and paste it. But the logic is basically if the due date um, has nothing, it'll display unsure of the due date. So let's do an example for this. Unsure of due date because I haven't entered it. And then if date time format is just uh, making it so the code reads the date exactly how we have it, so month, day. So if the due date equals one day from now, so this is where you can input, if you want it two days before, a week before, put seven, you get the point. Um, if it's one day before, put true. So right now it's um, the 15th, and so the 16th, it's displaying true. And then um, if it's not, all you have to do to have something that's not, you put comma and then not due in one day. So let's change it just for fun. Nope. Just so we have a, a little bit of contrast. Confirm change. There we go. So we have our trues and our nope, that's not true. So here's the automation. Once you have those three columns, your due date, which is manually inputted, your now, which is just whatever day it is, and then this formula, which I'll put in the description again, which displays whether something needs a date, has it, or is true. Then we can go to our automations. And this is it already built, but we can build it right now just so you can see the flow. Um, basically, all you're going to need to do is create an automation, and then you're going to go when record matches conditions, and then select your table. So I'm going to do homework tracker, but just whatever your table is called up um, under the data. And then conditions. This is the interesting part. So when, and you're going to go do in one day, then change this to is, and then true. So this is basically reading that it as when it's true that it's due in one day, and then we can add our automation. How cool is that? This choose a record is just to test it. I want an email, personally. So two, you can enter your email address. And then you can add a subject. Um, do um, I'm going to say assignment. So if the assignment matches the record in one day, there we go. Okay, let's generate a preview. That's awesome. So this is the email that's going to come into my inbox when something is due in one day. Let's see if it works when I turn it on. Saving. Oh, this is awesome. Here we go. I don't know if you all can see that, but Airtable. Make sure to do your online quiz today or tomorrow. I gotta do that. Oh, this is maybe for my test. Um, when you enter, um, what do you call it? When you enter the due date or change it, it'll like automatically update. But yeah, that's how you do it. You can change it for, um, where is it? For, you know, three days before. All you gotta do is change three like that. And then, see, now I have some due in three days, so it says true. Um, super easy. I hope this was helpful.